Hey guys, with it being Star Wars Eve, I thought that I would share with you our Star Wars collection. Let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that we'll start with are the bobbleheads. Kylo Ren, Yoda, Boba Fett, and Vader. Okay, so in this series we have Finn and we have Kylo Ren, and it has descriptions on the back of their boxes, which are pretty cool to read through. And um, they're pretty cool figures. They're made of plastic, um, so this cloth like doesn't move or anything, but... Um, uh, <laughs> Finn comes with a gun and Kylo Ren comes with his lightsaber. Okay, so the next set that we're going to look at here is our Star Wars Lego set. Um, it's the BARC speeder and the sidecar. 226 pieces of fun. Um, so we put it all together and it's pretty cool. <laughs> and we display it in the office. Okay, then over here we have the ATST, the ATST driver from the forest moon of Endor. Those guys are pretty cool. And they come on this little stand um, in the Lego set. So those are currently all the Legos that we have in the office right now. Okay, so here's the group of the minifigures that we have out of the boxes. We have Han Solo, Luke Skywalker, Boba Fett, Chewbacca, and Darth Vader who wants to hang out by himself. Okay, so here's a look at our um, minifigures that are still in the packages from Left to right, we have the Star Wars Black Series, um, number three, Darth Vader. And the next one, we have uh, Princess Leia in her ceremonial dress with her Medal of Honor. <laughs> and then we have um, Anakin Skywalker, RTV2, and the Snow Trooper Commander. So those are pretty cool. All right, so now the figures are getting a little bit taller. And from left to right again, we have Obi Wan Kenobi, Chewbacca. Zero One Sand Trooper and Boba Fett. All right, once again, going from left to right, we have Luke Skywalker, the First Order Stormtrooper from the new movie. We have Rey, and we've got Kylo Ren. Oh, and I almost forgot BB-8. He's in there too. All right, so now we are upgrading once again to our collector series. From left to right, we have C-3PO, Chewbacca, and Luke Skywalker. So this is what they look like on the inside, which is pretty cool. And then on the left side of them, you can see there on C-3PO, there's a whole story and a background about the character. So, um, yep, these are part of our collection. And then on the back of the boxes, it challenges you to collect them all. I wonder if they ever did come out with a collector fleet. I'll have to look for it. All right, so we currently own two Millennium Falcons. The one on the left is the quadricopter toy. And it is really cool. Um, you can fly it inside and outside and it has these cool lights on the front and the back. And even sound effects when you get to playing with it. And the next one, <laughs> it shoots these little Nerf things uh, that the dog likes to chase around. So those are our two current Millennium Falcons. The next group of stuff is just kind of like little things. Um, we have a coffee mug and then we have a four piece collector glass set with little shot glasses. I'll kind of get a little closer. We've got Leia, Han Solo, Vader, and Luke for party time <laughs> or whatever time. And then we got these cool buttons when we went to get the new toys that came out um, about a month ago. So super cool, just like little things that we have added to the collection. Okay, so now we're getting into our VHS trilogy set. So on the left, we found a really cool one. All of these things we've mostly found at like thrift stores and secondhand stores and things like that. Like you can see like price stickers on some of them, like 50 cents, 65 cents, but we've usually picked them up because they have really cool covers or they were gifts. So um, those are pretty cool. I'll kind of zoom in for you guys so you can see them. The trilogy set. Uh, there's really cool cases on these for the VHS's, and then we go down into our just regular standard DVDs, and then the Blu-ray collection. So yeah, that is our Blu-ray and VHS collection for Star Wars. This is the Darth Vader head that I found at a thrift store for my husband. It has a metal center, and it is literally stacks of paper through that metal center. So I'll kind of try to show you guys a little bit here. So it's all stacked up and it makes this really, really, really cool um, Darth Vader head as you can see here. Now I do have a full video of um, making the head and how I put it in the box and stuff, which is kind of cool, but um, yes, that is a really, really cool piece that we love in the office. So this collection piece did just come as the head. 
And so I put the head in a box and I took it home and I dusted it all over um, with a paintbrush and then I put it in this beautiful frame and eventually we're going to add like a light to the top so it kind of like really features this awesome Lord Vader head. And then to just finish up the video we have some posters in the office. We have another one over here which is pretty cool. I like the old school ones. I think they look better. <laughs> and then a lightsaber randomly right there. And that will conclude our Star Wars Eve party. I hope you guys enjoyed the collection. If you want to see our Jurassic Park collection, get this video to 100 thumbs up and share with your friends. And we will see you guys tomorrow for the premiere.